This is India's deadly Prolay missile. The DRDO successfully test launched this next-gen quasi-ballistic missile from the Abdul Kalam island of India's Odisha coast. With a range of 350 to 500 kilometers and a payload capacity of up to 1,000 kilograms, any targets within Pakistan are well within reach, along with Chinese military positions in Tibet. The Pralai packs a punch, and this missile is like none other in the Indian military arsenal. It's been compared to Beijing's Dongfeng-12 and Russia's Iskander, which is wreaking havoc in Ukraine. Pralai is what's called a hard-to-kill missile. So what makes India's Pralai so deadly? Can it evade Chinese and Pakistani air defense systems? And how will it boost India's strike capabilities? The DRDO claims the Pralai test was successful, meeting all parameters. This was the first test for the missile since 2021. The quasi-ballistic surface-to-surface missile will soon be ready to patrol the LSE and the LOC. With imaging and radio seekers, it has the ability to change its path mid-air throughout its trajectory. Unlike the fixed trajectory of ballistic missiles, Pralai has a horizontal trajectory, never leaving the atmosphere. This makes it difficult to predict and thus hard to intercept or kill. Pralai is a game-changer, specially designed to thwart enemy interceptor missiles and their air defense systems. While supersonic stealth cruise missiles have fared badly in Ukraine, Russia's Iskander has proven highly effective. Pralai is based on similar principles to counter enemy air defense systems. With a speed of 2,000 km per hour, Pralai is also equipped with modern features like an infrared or thermal scanner for nighttime accuracy. The Pralai missile joins forces with the renowned Brahmos supersonic cruise missile and will be a key component of India's newly proposed rocket force. This dynamic duo equips India's military with the power to strike enemy positions in the heat of the battle. For now, these missiles will be deployed with the conventional warheads. Both China and Pakistan have their own tactical ballistic missiles and now India stands a step ahead, ready for any face-off along its borders. Now, if you found this video informative, then subscribe to our channel or hit the like button so that it can reach more viewers.